Hello and welcome to Flying Bobbins. I'm Liz and today I'm going to talk you through how to make the V2000 Diane von Furstenberg wrap dress by Vogue. Now this is a really beautiful pattern. It is a reproduction of an original vintage Vogue pattern um, created in collaboration with renowned designer Diane von Furstenberg. Um, now, also known as DVF, um, Diane von Furstenberg invented and popularised the iconic wrap dress that we can see here. Um, and this is a beautiful style that was um, made popular in the 1970s, very chic, very easy to wear. And it's really um, stood the test of time and become a much loved wardrobe staple. So I'm really excited to say that they have um, re-released this pattern. Um, in all its glory, lots of beautiful original details in there um, so that we can all now make our very own iconic Diane von Furstenberg wrap dress. So this will feature, this sew along will feature as the sew along project of the month in my sew along club for the month of August 2024. I'm going to video myself cutting it out, cutting out the fabric, measuring up, making the dress all the way through the different stages, giving you tips and techniques as I go along. So you can sew along with me with confidence and make your very own beautiful DVF wrap dress. If you're a member of the Sew Along Club, then you will notice that there is a choice of kits that you can purchase to go along with this Sew Along as well. So if you've already bought your kit, that should be with you by now. Um, otherwise, um, if you've ordered it more recently, then it's on its way. The DVF wrap dress by Vogue comes in two different sizes. You have the standard size set, which goes from a six up to um, a size 14, and then the extended size range, which goes from a size 16 up to a 24. So just to give you an idea, that is a bust for the six is a 30 and a half inch bust, um, up to a size 14, which is a 36 inch bust, and then a 16, which is a 38 inch bust, up to a size 24, which is a 46 inch bust. So there's a good size range, and you can find more details on this pattern at my website, flyingbobbins.com, and I shall pop a link in the description below. Now this pattern, I've already, as you can see, made up one version of this dress, and I used this lightweight um, scuba crepe jersey by Lady McElroy, just because I absolutely loved the colours on the print. Um, you can make this pattern in a jersey or a woven. Now when I think of Diane von Furstenberg wrap dresses, I automatically think of the, like, the jersey dress, you know, that's um, a very easy way to wear this dress, but you can also make, you know, use this pattern and make this in a woven fabric as well. So it makes it really, really versatile. And I've seen versions of this made up in beautiful chambres, for example, which looks really, really great. Um, so it's a very versatile pattern. Once you've got this pattern and you've got it fitting you nicely and you understand the construction and the techniques. It's one of those patterns that you can just go back to again and again and recreate in different ways. Now the pattern itself has a couple of different variations on the styling. You have a knee length and a full length version. So everyday glamour and evening wear looks there. Um, you also can choose to make it with or without a collar and with or without these feature cuffs here. So you can mix and match the styles as you wish. Now this dress wraps over at the waist, it's a full wrap, so the under layer goes all the way around to the side seam. The belt then pops through a hole um, in the side seam, wraps around the back and ties at the front. And it's a really nice, generous, wide, long tie to just give it that real touch of glamour. The cuffs have um, a button feature and this lovely winged sort of profile. And then I chose not to do a, uh, a collar on this style just because it's a slightly heavier fabric, um, but you also do have a collar option as well. So I've already made this dress. I'm now going to talk you through uh, making my dress in a sort of a, a cotton jersey, a slightly lighter weight fabric. Um, so that's what I'm going to be working on in this sew along. But as I go through, I'll teach you some tips and techniques for uh, whichever fabric you're going to be using.
Other features of this beautiful style, you have quite a lovely bust dart here. Um, you have some gathers in the waist seam. You have um, shoulder darts at the back, tucks at the back as well. A beautiful full skirt. There's a facing that runs all the way across the front and a really deep hem that gives that skirt some nice weight so it drapes really nicely. And it's a beautifully put together pattern, um, really fantastically designed as, as you would expect. So let's get started with the sew along. If you want to join in with the full sew along, you can see a description or a link in the comments below how to join the sew along club or how to purchase this full sew along um, as a one-off. Um, and I look forward to serving with you.